In the world of electronic circuit design, selection of the right voltage regulator is one of the most important decisions. Virtually every product that runs on DC power employs voltage regulation. But what exactly does this device do? As the name indicates, voltage regulators take variable or unstable input voltages and convert them to higher or lower constant output that matches the voltage and current needs of an electronic circuit. Basic regulators of the linear IC type simply drop down the source to the desired level and shed the rest as heat, while others, such as the switching type, are more efficient. Simply stated, rapidly switching a voltage input on and off results in an averaged voltage output. Depending upon switching frequency, a wide range of voltages are possible from a single source. Some regulators employ additional features capable of handling large voltage spikes reverse polarity protection, or removing unwanted signal noise. Automotive alternators, as an example, convert mechanical, rotational energy of varying RPM into alternating electrical current for use in electrical systems and charging the vehicle's battery. Most alternators employ a built-in AC to DC rectifier and a robust voltage regulator capable of delivering 13.5 to 14.5 volts DC in excess of 100 amps. Each device in the electrical system may have its own voltage regulator depending on its specific needs. Common voltages are 12 volts DC for lighting and accessories and 5 volts DC for sensors and control modules. Linear regulators use a transistor controlled by feedback from a differential amplifier circuit and a reference voltage to control output voltage. They may feature fixed or adjustable output. Output current is determined by the input current minus circuit operation losses. Linear regulators are simple to add and give a fast response time, but are not very efficient. The output of a linear regulator is always lower than the input and drops out if the input voltage is too low. Switching regulators are very efficient, but can be difficult to design. As mentioned earlier, switching regulators use controllers to rapidly connect and disconnect either the positive or negative component of the source voltage from the rest of the converter circuit to produce desirable changes in voltage and current. A feedback loop from the output to the controller helps to determine the switching rate. The arrangement of inductors, capacitors, and diodes in basic switching converters determines if the output voltage is increased or decreased. Buck converters reduce voltage. Boost converters increase voltage. Buck boost converters can increase or decrease voltage, but reverse the polarity. Flyback transformers increase voltage to very high levels, but at very low current, by collapsing the field of an energized coil, much like the ignition system in some automobiles. Now that you have an understanding of the basic functionality, types, and common applications of voltage regulators, be sure to check out the vast selection on digikey.com to be implemented into your next project. Want to watch more videos like this? Like and subscribe!